All right, guys, make sure you can see me. How are you? Give me a thumbs up. Recording. Cool. Three, two, one. All right, Electro Swing Workshop. We got May 12th. We were working on solo footwork, no partner, partner work, but we talked about how this could be put into partner dancing, right? Partner application. So the idea is what we started with was Ninja Cat, right? Sports ready position. Find that hinge in the thighs. So the idea is if you bring your chest forward over top, like I'm thinking shoulders over top of knees. Balance the ratio, right? You want to bend in three joints. The ankle, the knee, and especially the shoulder over the knees. Cool? Um, the idea behind this is it keeps my weight from being backwards, right? So I keep it forwards, then I can rotate, right? Very, very agile. What we started with was the counter walk. The name of the game, we found balance, right? And then I said, okay, we're going to paint the floor. And where you stop and relax the leg, that's your natural step. So if I was to move to the side, same thing. The difference, going to turn it out 45 degrees, right? So I've got this V-shape to start, and then I'm going heel. Contact with the floor. It's really important that you change weight. So when I dip, right, I'm thinking pull, boom. So I'm heel, pull, heel, Pull. And then the switch, same thing, put the foot down, now my weight's on my left foot, heel, pull. And we talked about tucking it in, creating the hook behind. Don't tuck it under, because if you want to switch, you'll step on your own foot, right? So keep that in mind. If you want to switch, it doesn't go under. It looks really cool when you do hook behind and tuck it under, but just don't step on your own foot. Um, and it's very much Kodak moment. One moment, two moments. So one moment, two more, right? Yeah, changing the weight each time. Um, then we did, what did we do? We went camel walks to knee flaps? And the alternating camel walks. Ah, alternating camel walks, boom, switch. Boom, switch. And I said it was cooler to walk forward, um, more plain if we're just going sideways. Right? I like four. So alternating camel walks, and then we went into the knee flap. So now, same thing, ninja cat, but I'm going to plant my weight on my heels, free up the toes. So I'm going out, in, back to center, out, in. We talked about not going too big, crazy turnout, right? Just a little, especially the faster you go. Once you get comfortable with your feet doing what they need to do, don't look down at them. Now your head weighs 18 to 20 pounds, it keys your frame and does a lot of problems with your balance. So out and out and. Yeah? We talked about single rhythms. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Yeah? Doubles would be stepping every beat. Oh, battery will. <laughs> we have to get it off mark <laughs> next time. Um, so if I step every beat, boom, boom, boom. Boom, that's a double. If I step one, hold, two, hold, that's a single. Cool? Um, and then we did the skates. So the skates came from a toe, heel, toe. Oh, this is in and then out. So we went out and then in. So these are out and ins. Do, 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 do. I'm using the hip. You guys talked about doing the twist. Yeah, this became James Brown crawl. We talked about sticky floors, pick up the foot and crawl. If you have toms or slippery shoes, slide, 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 slide. It comes from the drive and then skate. Drive and then skate. We did a little chorus. One, two, three. One, two, three. I talked about with that, pointing the foot, keeping the anchor of that foot. So I'm not putting a lot of weight on it, but I'm definitely applying pressure into the floor so my legs stay, so I don't wiggle both legs. And do, 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 do. final thing. Ah, we did happy feet. Right. So the key to this is the same action of the knee flap, but what we're going to do is go one 
ball one, you know, three now, and we did 